uh, before I became a distributor. And in that process, in that time, doTERRA had been around for five years. And doTERRA was founded by seven people. Uh, and the seven people were still involved in the day-to-day -day, uh, activities of our company that, at that point. And I was the US sales manager. <clears throat> and so when we did our post-convention tour events, uh, you got one of the seven owners or me uh, to come to your town. And we did them a little different back then. Uh, but occasionally I would get paired up with an owner. I presented with Rob or I presented with Emily. But this particular time I presented with Dave Sterling. Um, he's not currently uh, involved because he's doing a commitment for his church right now, but he was our CEO from the beginning of time until about a year and a half ago. And uh, Dave and I were traveling on the East Coast uh, in the US and we were driving between uh, events and co-impact sourcing didn't exist. That wasn't a term. Nothing like that had to exist. And he said, what we want to do is just the two of us driving in this car. We want to create these co-ops so that farmers can come and bring um, you know, the thing that they know more than anything about to a safe place that they can get guaranteed payments, that we know, you know what's going on in their soils, how they're treating it, how they're growing the plants, their workers, their names. That's what we really want. That's our long-term vision for doTERRA. And I was like, cool, Dave, you know? <laughs> like I didn't really have a whole lot of vision with that. I just, I'm like, I thought we were just buying oils from people and vendors. But <clears throat> that was the really the beginning uh, of, I, it wasn't the beginning, it was something he had, he had thought about. But that was before co sourcing was a thing. And when it was launched a couple years later, mm -hmm. I thought, wow, how, what great insight or foresight Dave and his partners had mm -hmm. to bring it because when it comes to co-impact sourcing, you can't look at co-impact sourcing and not look at the impact that doTERRA is having on both sides of the bottle. So I, I love that you brought that part up because it does make us different than the three other direct sales that you've, you've been in most likely, right? Uh, or other corporate jobs that you've had to work for 12 hours. Like mm. th this, this is something that has more weight. When you can learn about five generation families in Sicily that are growing bergamot and their grandpa did it, and their grandpa did it, and their grandpa did it, and they know the most about Bergamo, and we're leaning on that expertise, and we're investing in their infrastructure, and then we're bringing them a place where they can get a good payment. That creates more than just a good business transaction, that creates a real bond and a real relationship. So thanks for sharing that.